Hello and welcome to this episode of Judgment TV. Today we're playing Find the Hamsters. So instead of like normal where I will edit the video down just to show you the locations, I will literally just be doing a straight run through and a walk through this game. So it says click the correct square to find the puzzle hamster. So I'm clicking away. No idea which one's going to give it to me. I think I've fit them all now. Let's start again. Don't have to touch it. I've done all the squares. <laughs> oh, oh, one of them's worked. <laughs> okay, so for that one, you're just going to have to go into shift lock or first player and just keep pressing all the squares. I can't tell you which colour that worked from. Nifty one hidden down there. Don't think there's any others. A little hamster tucked behind the tree there. You know there's going to be one in the sunflowers. And there he is, sunflower seed hamster. So this game looks reasonably easy, um, obviously starting off. Um, I'm not going to say it's going to be easy all the way through because with a lot of these games they're really easy on kind of, you know, the first look of it and when you start walking around and you realise that there's all hidden passages and obbies and all these ridiculous things you've got to do to get these, um, these badges. This one's still looking nice and easy. Being really thorough as I'm walking around to make sure I don't miss anything. So we're going to the snow one next. Still doesn't seem to be any hamsters that are kind of too taxing at least. Makes a nice change sometimes to do quite an easy scavenger hunt. <laughs> Got the angel on top of the snowman. Oh, cheeky one behind the snowman. Random cave yet with no hamster in it. Oh, because it's cheekily on the ceiling behind the icicles. And there's ice hamster. I have to try and remember which ones I've gone into and which ones haven't. So again, strategically looking around absolutely everything, make sure we don't miss a thing. I don't think I'm going to need to walk down like all the walls because I don't think there's kind of hidden passages in this one. Usually I'll be bumping up against walls and all sorts to try and find these badges. We've got lava hamster on top and a cheeky domino one behind. So I think that's it for this one. We're going to watch the thing. We've got cherry blossoms. And nothing there. Flowers are making it a tad more awkward to see. Don't want to miss anything. Is 
there's an invisible truss there taking us up to the treetops. Doesn't seem to be anything in this tree, but there is one over in this other tree. We'll jump across and go and get it. We've got the Kura hamster. I'm sure there's going to be more than one. There's normally at least two so far. Ah, and there we go. There's pink hamster. Okay, so that's pretty colour coordinated according to kind of the area that we're in. Obviously, we had Domino for lava. In the volcano, we've just had pink there, so I'm assuming we might find green somewhere. Oh, and there we have it. I thought I bumped into something. There's green and hidden in the bush. Is that slightly more difficult? Not as obvious. We've just jumped up and got B. So we'll just check the rest of the bushes to make sure nothing else is hiding in there. I think that's it. So we're going to move into the orchard. Oh, we just found camo in a bush again, right next door to orange. Doesn't look anything up there. We found our two, but I think we'll just double check everywhere. Oh, there's one in the tree there. That's probably going to be apple or red. Oh, and it's Cherry Hamster. I haven't actually looked how many hamsters I've got to find or <laughs> what they're called or what they look like. I'm just kind of going in here blind. So moving into the kind of waterfall place now. So there's one tucked up in the waterfall, is that Stormy Hamster? Again, just being super thorough, trying to check everywhere, make sure we don't miss anything. And there's Bug Hamster. No. Okay, we slid down. <laughs> Not quite what we wanted to do. At least I didn't oof. So it's going to take me a fair while to walk, so we're going to teleport back by pressing respawn. So let's do this cloud one just by spawn. Ooh. So we've got winking hamster just by the cloud there. So we'll do a nice easy cloud obby. I'm thinking this would be a really great game for kind of kids. Yeah, um, it's really nice and easy, be kind of a nice introduction to kind of scavenger hunts. Um, I think if you started to play kind of like find the domo and find the worms, which are kind of impossible, um, it might put kids off from playing these kind of games. Oh, there's one tucked behind the tree there. I might get uh, the judge and little judge on this one, see how they go on find the hamsters. Invariably with these types of games, they end up asking me where they all are. Um, that looks a bit weird, but... Oh, and it is one! It's hamster question mark, I think, because it looks like a frog. That was a bit of a weird one. I 
don't think we've done sand yet, so let's go back and find sand. sand hamster and one tucked up in the brolly is red hamster just thinking if there's one in the palm tree that would be kind of cool place to hide one not look to be anything up there so i think that's it for the kind of beach so we're back in the b one we're done down there so let's have a look at our checklist Yellow hamster. Okay, so I evidently haven't been somewhere yet then. Shadow. Pudding, I haven't got that one. That's all looking good. Oh, caramel I haven't got. We evidently have missed somewhere. Right. So I don't think I've checked out the place with the birthday candles in the back there. I don't think I've done this one with the vines. Not quite sure how I missed this one. So I walked through it on the way to the beach. So we've got one called Shadow, so if Shadow's going to be anywhere, it's going to be in this one for sure. It's quite dark. Oh, but we've just found Yellow, so that's another one off the list. And we've got another truss going up into the trees. I see it poking up over there. And we found green heart hamster and shadow hamster in the bush. I thought it might be. So let's make our way over to where like the birthday candles are. And I'm thinking I'll probably find the ones I haven't got over there. Just double check, I think. So again, the checklist has a bug in it. So there's 35 badges that says I only own one. Yeah, as you can see, I own actually all of them, I think now. So that's another bug with these. Seems to be quite a common problem. But that's it, we've got all 35 now. So do give this one a blast if you um, have a bit of spare time for a bit of a quick and easy scavenger hunt. Again, really good for the younger kind of Roblox players. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Bye.